Hi, this is Eric with Parts Doctor. Today we're going to show you how to replace the main control board in your GE refrigerator. If you need to purchase a new main control board for your refrigerator, check out our website, partsdoctor.com, where we sell parts for all major appliance brands. The main control board acts as the brain of the refrigerator. If it fails, the refrigerator may begin to act erratically, fail to cool properly, or may simply stop working. Since we will be working with the refrigerator's electrical components, disconnect the power to the refrigerator. With access to the back of the refrigerator, remove the screws holding the main control board cover in place using a quarter inch nut driver. Because the main control board is connected to so many wiring harnesses, take a picture to reference later to make installation easier. Then disconnect all electrical connectors by depressing the locking tabs. Next, remove the screw holding the control board in place. Remove the control board by swinging the left side out and then pulling gently forward. If you need to purchase a new main control board, you can check out our website, partsdoctor.com. We'll leave a link in the description below. You want to make sure you are searching with the model number from the tag on your refrigerator to make sure you are getting the correct part. To install, align the holes on the control board to the prongs on the refrigerator housing. Then, insert the right side first so that it seats behind the retaining tabs and swing the left side into place. Then, reinstall the screw. Next, referencing your photo from earlier, reconnect the electrical connectors. Finally, insert the main control board cover beneath the lip and reinstall the two screws. And that's it for today's video, and if you found this video helpful, make sure to leave a like and comment down below, and for more videos like this, please consider subscribing.